I think it looks quite well on the Haro Still Reserve. Hey everybody, I'm Drew the Tattoo Chap, and today we're gonna be installing some new handlebars, grips, and a stem on my dirt jumper. So tune in and check it out. Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in today. And like I said, we're gonna be installing some new handlebars, a stem, and new grips on my dirt jumper. I have a Haro Steel Reserve, and the original stem is just maybe a little bit too long, a little bit too bulky, so I decided to get something different. And I also wanted some more robust handlebars, like not that I'm that good, but yeah. Anyways, so I got myself some Spank handlebars. They are the Spoon 40 bar which should be more than sufficient for my skill level. The diameter here is the 31.8. Um, comes with the nifty little mud guard here that I'll probably put on my daughter's mountain bike because she doesn't have one yet. It's kind of cool that you get one of these for free. Also, I got myself, and I also got myself the Spank Rastafari colored stem. Pretty cool looking. And last but not least, I really enjoy the Colt Vans BMX grips. And so I got myself some red ones to kind of go with the Rastafarian color scheme. They're a little bit longer than your traditional uh, mountain bike grips, and that's okay for me. I'm, I'm not trying to win anybody's friendship by the type of grips that I wear, but these are what I prefer. So this is what we're gonna go with. And if you haven't seen these before, what's really cool about them is it's a collaboration between Colt BMX and Vans shoes. And if you look closely, you can see the Vans tread that is on the bottom of their shoes is actually on their grips. Now, if you like this, they also have tires that have the same grip pattern that are on the bottom of Vans shoes. I don't know how the tires work because I don't have those, but I love these grips. And here's also a close up of the Spank stem. And it is a shorter stem, a little bit closer to the steering tube and Kind of cool colors. And it's definitely gonna be a lot lighter. And also, as you've already seen, here are the handlebars. Gonna look a lot cooler. I'll show you a close up of what I have already on my bike. So this is what I already have on my bike. And you can see that it's definitely longer than the one that I have. And you can see these handlebars are just one inch all the way through and they're sufficient. They work, but I wanted to get something maybe a little bit lighter and also a little bit closer since I'm a shorter rider. And you can see I got my Colt grips, my old ones, the purple ones. I got these for free from Colt, so I threw them on there. I prefer the Vans ones over these, but these ones are pretty cool too. So let's take things apart and put them on and see what they look like once they're done. And overall, I think it looks quite good on the Haro Steel Reserve. So, yeah. So I got the stuff installed and I'll show you what it looks like, the stem compared to the others, so you can see the difference and see if this is something maybe that you wanna do. So this right here is the original Haro stem that came on the Steel Reserve. You can see its length and it's pretty solid, right? This thing's not gonna break, but it is quite heavy. And for a short guy like me, it is a little long. Comparatively, you can see the length of the two stems. And also you can probably see kind of the weight difference that it's probably gonna have. And here are the handlebars. Again, these are just regular one inch bars, nothing special about them. Here you can see the difference of the bars. Ultimately, I think it looks a little bit better. It has a little bit more character to it. And um, I think it's going to be a little bit better for me due to my height. 
And overall, I'm, I'm stoked. And for my skill level, I don't think this will be um, detrimental to my writing in any sort of way. Yeah, so anyways, thank you for watching. I hope you liked this. And if you did, make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe if you haven't already done so. This channel, it's about outdoor stuff, hiking, riding bikes, and my life as a chaplain in the army. So if you like any of those kinds of things, make sure to subscribe. Yeah, anyways, thanks for tuning in. Hope you had a great day. And we'll see you guys next time on the Tattooed Chap. Have a great day. Bye.